John Myers. I'm an assistant wrestling coach at Poway High School, and I teach here also. How did I start wrestling? Uh, when I was about three years old, my father was a, a coach, a kid's coach, and my two older brothers wrestled also. So I got involved just kind of rolling around with, with the team that they were on, and then at about five years old, I started actually competing in little kids' tournaments. Um, it's basically, it, it, it drives my life. Everything that I do is kind of um, uh, because of wrestling. I teach because I started wrestling. I coach because I started wrestling. All the lessons that I teach my kids um, are, are from wrestling also, so it, it's the driving force in my life. Probably the biggest reason is that um, I wanted to give back in the same way that coaches have given to me, um, giving their time, not only for coaching wrestling, but also mentoring. Um, so uh, I, I felt like I had to give back myself. Just, uh, high school, I, I won the state tournament four years in Connecticut. Uh, I went on to wrestle at the University of Minnesota. Um, I was a university national champion. Uh, While well, I wrestled at Minnesota, I wrestled overseas uh, for the United States team, freestyle and Greco-Roman. Uh, traveled to China, Mongolia, Finland, Germany to wrestle. Um, a couple times All-American as far as freestyle and Greco goes. Uh, at the time, I was a I had never visited San Diego before and I, I was a college coach in Connecticut for five years and I came out here to recruit some kids and just really loved uh, the area, did a little surfing while I was out here with some friends and I just fell in love with San Diego and um, I contacted one of my old roommates from Minnesota and he mentioned a couple different schools and I, I started at a different school down in East County and um, I basically was offered a job teaching along with coaching at Poway and uh, I, I really like the philosophy of the head coach Wayne Branstetter and um, so I decided to transfer up to Poway so I've been here since 2002. Um, I hope it's this you know I think it's the same thing the, the program and me uh, just a lot a lot of different lessons it's individual too but some of the overlaying lessons that are that are learned or just how hard work can kind of um, overtake any problems you have um, uh, just being a, a good citizen and, and, and um, you know after high school um, becoming someone that people can rely on and, and that's dedicated to something and whether that's being a good father or, or brother or worker um, just trying to instill in them um, you know, what I've gone through and, and, and becoming a good citizen. Um, as a team, how do we look next year? Uh, I think every year is a year we can win the state championship, so I'm hoping that again. And um, I, I think we're real solid from, from all weights. We're probably we're looking for somebody to fill in uh, a couple of weights, maybe two weights. But overall, other than that, about 12 of the weights, I think we have kids who can actually place at the state tournament which means you know, if you get up around eight or nine kids that can place at the state tournament, you can win it. So that's, that's our goal. Yeah, Myers, he's, he's um, more than just a wrestling coach. Like, he's taught me how to be a man. Like, I know I'm not there yet, but what he's done for me is like, more of a figure. Like, he's taught me how to be a man and mature and grow up and taught me what like, ideals I need and um, what it takes to grow up. I mean, the age that we're at right now, you know, wrestling is such an impact and having a role model like him is just like ridiculously helpful and um, I, like, I really appreciate what he does. He, um, he coaches us through wrestling but everything that we do in wrestling translates to like our everyday life, like not giving up and like working on things the same way. It teaches a mental toughness that like he's taught me how to get past. I mean every time I feel like quitting or stopping because it hurts or because I'm tired, I just learned that I can push past that, and, um, and that just translates to like other things like, outside of wrestling. You know, every ambition that I have.
And uh, why do we play softball in the off season? What's, what's the... That's a good question. Um, well, no, to be honest, I, I think... Um, <laughs> I think I think that you guys work really hard all year long, um, and, and a lot of people don't realize how work how hard you guys work with the PE class and then after school and on the weekends. Um, the wrestlers need a, a chance to kind of kick back and have some fun, so that that's what that's for. Kind of unwind and, and not be on the grind, so to speak, all the time, wrestling or lifting or something.